Hi everyone, I hope you are. This is Coins Kid. Just going to dive into XRP once again. Thank you for support. Okay, big up the Coins Kid crew. So you can see XRP in this little ascending triangle coiled up, and then we look at, like I said to you, when you get really close to the, the apex there, there's always a reaction, isn't there? You know, even here, we've got this little apex just there. You coil up, coil up, boom, reaction basically. So right now, we have actually lost support, and we're beginning to retrace here. Okay, we've got really overextended, ran into the 1272, and we're beginning to retrace to the continue for the continuation of a trend basically. So if we do that, take a look at the daily time frame here you can see that this is really good basically uh, at the moment we've got a little bit overextended look at the big green candles and you're falling back into the EMA support you're almost on the cusp here of creating a beautiful buy and go to the beach falling back into it as support so that could be a golden little entry point if it does come on the 20 EMA is it, this starts to come up okay and that starts to cross you get the beautiful buy and go to the beach you've fallen into it as support that's an amazing signal right there okay uh, the last time we got one of them was just down here after this low double bottom start to come up fell back into it as support and then got your breakout to the resistance just there okay and you, you're pretty much mirroring it we did a bit of a fake out in and out down here but again you held it and where did you go to eventually that level of resistance so this is what we're looking for we're looking to come up to this resistance okay this is the most important part isn't it we're looking to attack that resistance just there for xrp because once we start to close that you're confirming the breakout of a huge horizontal descending triangle whatever you want to call it but it is actually some kind of horizontal because you've got a series of higher lows just there okay so it is actually a horizontal not necessarily a descending triangle which is quite a negative pattern to be honest with you so yes yeah, it is some kind of horizontal at the moment coiling up inside of it getting close to the apex like i said to you again you may get rejected there start to come back hold that support like this boom, 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 and then break out eventually or lose support obviously there's no guarantees so we're still sort of caught in this big big horizontal at the moment so you know if xrp does start to put in this beautiful retracement right here looks nasty on the lower time frames but you start to zoom out it doesn't look that bad okay and potentially i think on the weekly time frame i was looking earlier there is a bit of a pattern that i'm beginning to spot and this is a potential pattern okay so Look at that where you run into resistance just there where this open and uh, close sorry and open literally right there is where your resistance is okay you are falling right now below, below the 20 and the 55 so that's not healthy because you do want to see yourself above them to confirm the uptrend on the weekly okay so right now you, you are coming down you run into resistance so potentially right now i'm going to show you a key level support for xrp just there okay now look at that wick just there that support where you close just there and where you're open just there that is where there's a key level support so straight away off the bat that would be a, a bit of a support level for me 74 cents for xrp um, and with that you can see that you know if you do start to do that you've got the right uh, left shoulder sorry you've got this head that you ran it into resistance just there and then potentially start to come back over the next few weeks create this right shoulder holding these lows right now and you start to come back up and you, you're on that white line basically and you've done something like this boom 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 okay do you see that so this is what i'm looking at because if if that is actually a valid inverse and shoulders pattern just there that you are beginning to form for xrp where you come back and hold the lows like that and start to come back back up and attack that level of resistance which is roughly that 91 cents so if you start to break that that is actually a pattern that's beginning to emerge on the weekly time frame and it's called an inverse head and shoulders pattern okay in a large horizontal which gives you a breakout target of this level of resistance just there and that would be your technical target around about 138 and you can see with that that if you do start to do that and you start to create this little inverse and shoulders pattern here on the weekly time frame holding this ascending level support as well okay you know we use the wicks like that it's still high low you see that you know it's big whopping horizontal basically now if you hold this okay inside this pattern you're breaking out of this horizontal which gives you a technical break target from there to there and you can see that once you break out there wherever it is boom you're up there and you're on your way and you're putting that big big parabolic move here for xrp pretty much like this did when it broke this high you got the big big parabolic move moving to the uh, the 1618 fib off this high and low which we all traded together okay look take a look at this from there to there look at that absolutely knob on look at the wick on there 196 which is the target i was giving everybody because what you was doing you was moving up the stairs off here okay from there you pulsively retraced like i've shown you so many times you trace at this low and you're moving up and down the stairs impulsively and correctively so this this is this is pretty good this is pretty good looking forward because we've not lost these lows right now and that's the most important level like i said to you now the most important level right now is these lows okay forget about them lows right now 
these are, these are your new lows. These are your new lows that you don't want to lose. You start to lose them. That is negative. And you can see you're rolling out of a big, massive horizontal. And essentially, you know, you, you're making a series of low highs there. And you're rolling into the bear, you know. But this is good. This is a nice little continuation pattern. And essentially, we are starting to form some kind of big inverse and shoulders pattern. Potentially, it is a potential pattern inside here, right towards the apex, which is a bullish reversal pattern, which gives you a technical target of around about $1.38, which puts you outside of this horizontal which puts you in a technical target up to there now once you start to break that you're breaking that high and with that like i've shown you so many times for xrp you really are breaking bullish there and my minimal target for you would be from there to there and you'll be looking at that four dollars fifty minimal uh, okay let's get a knob on the wick so we can get the exact target yeah four dollars fifty three round about there and you know this is all progress breaking out coming up to that boom with that i think that level there that that technical breakout of the horizontal is actually a break at all time high and this is where you're going to get that big 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 push and that you know like you got that big push just there as well xrp so yeah let's watch this space there's no guarantees obviously but this is a really 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 important low right now for xrp and i do think that right now you are beginning to put in a retracement like i said to you on the daily uh, the more you zoom out the better it actually looks if you're looking at 15 minute you know look at 15 minute it looks horrible uh, the 15 minutes just coming down coming down oh no it's going to zero you know and you got the hour oh, it's coming down oh, it's going to zero but all you're doing is coming down to support you hold support you're going to start to come back up and um, one thing if you look on the daily right now you, you're on the cusp of forming a buy go to the beach that you're starting to fall back into a support you consolidate at that level start to come back up and attack that resistance you've got your big inverse head and shoulders pattern here haven't you you know and you start to break out you, you're looking up there at xrp so that's basically xrp hope you enjoyed that update stay healthy stay strong stay tuned take care everyone bye bye